Warning, the following content may contain elements that are not suitable for some audiences. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everybody and welcome back to GeoGuessr. I think we're in Russia. I, I don't know why, but I think we're in Russia. We're doing a world map today. I still don't know how to pronounce uh, that bullshit road yesterday. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, we're in Russia. I'd never play the Where in Russia Are We game. However, that was probably one of the best we've ever had. Forty-three ninety-nine. On to the next one. Ooh, hundred kilometers. Um, definitely not the United States. We are on the left-hand side of the road, so it looks like we could be in. Hold on, was that miles per hour or kilometers? kilometers uh we could be australia south africa england ireland scotland wales overtaking lane three kilometers ahead um i want to say australia or south africa mainly because of the trees you don't really see trees like this in england and it does seem a little bit more of a desert area even though there are hills and grasses, I don't know. It feels like we're probably not there. Uh, New Zealand could be a good guess because I, I know New Zealand has a lot of like mountains in certain areas. And every little bit of New Zealand is different. They have like all four fucking climates overtaking lane. Um, I think I think Australia would be a good bet. I do. You don't really see, like, I'm expecting, like, South Africa, right? I would expect to have more of a vibe to it, right? Like, maybe, like, in the United States, right? We have a yellow dividing line. That's just the United States. Um, I don't really see that anywhere else besides maybe Canada. I think Canada has the yellow line. I don't think Mexico does. So... You know, seeing the white line, we gotta we gotta like figure out something to definitely differentiate between South Africa and Australia because they both drive on the left hand side of the road, and they both generally look similar. Now I know they're two completely different places on two totally different continents, but all we all we really have going for us is kilometers, and we're on the left hand side of the road, and you know both of those places use kilometers and. They both just happen to drive on the left-hand side of the road. Now, we might be getting too far into this. We're on T6. I'm going to go until I see a sign. Hey, look, a sign. Um, this could give us a little bit of information. Tarly and Adelaide A32. Is it the Australian Outback that's A? No, I think that's actually South Africa. Get real down ours. I don't know why I want to guess over here, man. R. Um, I wonder if Australia, if we get close enough, will be A's. Nope, it'll be nothings. Got it. Um, A, yeah, so we're in Australia. So A87, we need to find A32. I think that's over here. Here's A4, A2, 71. Maybe it's a little bit closer. But I'm going to guess Queensland. Somewhere over here. And we're on the complete other side. 1448, not bad. Okay, winding road. What is this say? School bus route? Okay, so uh, Ireland maybe? Ireland, Scotland, England. Um, maybe. No, we're definitely not in a Nordic country because that wouldn't have said school bus route. That would have said something completely different. Uh, so definitely Wales, Scotland, Ireland, England. Ireland could be a good guess. This is as far as we go. Yeah, we're right on the fucking coast. Holy shit, that's gorgeous. Um, I'm going to say the southern tip of Ireland. 
it's gonna be the northern tip but I'm gonna say it anyway Wow look how cool this is you're right here man definitely definitely feels Ireland e ish esque whatever you want to call it driving along the coast these roads are pretty small let's see if this sign gives us anything Bailey's zero six yeah it's gotta be Ireland we're gonna be down here I've been here holy fuck we done fucked up <laughs> oh wow didn't even didn't even consider it man didn't even fucking consider it uh this reminds me of Russia but then again, we have straight roads with nothing on them. Oh my god. Uh, we could be in a Nordic country. I'm not going to rule those out. Um, we could also be probably like Poland, Belarus, you know, Eastern European countries. We just got to find a sign. That's all we That's all we do. You know, it's not GeoGuessr. It's Sign Locator. You find a sign, and then you guess. Sign Guesser? Can we call this Sign Guesser from now on? Because nobody just stops where they are and they're like, I know exactly where this is. This is Poland over by X, Y, and Z. Nobody fucking does it. Everyone looks for a fucking hint. Like this. Eastern European Russia. Eastern European or Russia. I'm going to go outside of Moscow this time. Not bad. A little bit further away, but we still got 1,100 points. So we're at 69.73. Now we're in a nice warm area. Probably Malaysia or India, based on this sign right here. Um, which, not bad. But we need like 1,400 points, which I think we'll be able to get. But this sign, this sign really gave it away. So we need like 1,400 points, right? And we're in this general region. However, we always seem to be in Singapore. Always. We're always in, like, right, either right outside of Singapore or Malaysia. So I'm just going to guess, like, here. Right? Like, that seems like a good guess. And it's the other side of the fucking island. But we still got 2375. So, I mean, we did break average. That, uh, that Ireland to New Zealand one. Wow. That, that was shit. Uh, but we did break average. We're at 93.48, which is pretty good. So, I mean, I do hope you all enjoyed watching this episode of GeoGuess. It's a little bit of a shorter episode, but we were able to fly right through that. Two rushes really fucking helped us. The longest we spent, I think, was in Australia. But I do hope you all enjoyed, and we'll see you all next time. Have a good rest of your day, and bye-bye.